Hogwarts Legacy captured the imagination of millions when it debuted in 2023, offering an immersive journey through the famed school of witchcraft and wizardry. Now, as rumors swirl about a definitive edition in the development, players are eagerly anticipating the expanded content, which is said to include 10 to 15 hours of new gameplay, with fresh stories, quests, side quests, activities, and outfits. As a fan of the professional observer of gaming trends, I've compiled a wishlist of what could make this edition truly live up to its name, blending what has worked so far with the opportunities for the improvement. Now, the original Hogwarts Legacy introduced players to a rich, lore-filled world where they could explore their identity as a young witch or a wizard. While the story was engaging, some players felt that their choices didn't carry enough weight. In a definitive edition, there's a potential to enhance the narrative by making choices more consequential. A branching storyline could allow players to feel that their decisions, whether in dialogue, quest completion, or even magical duels, have a lasting impact on the world around them. For example, imagine a new story quest that allows players to choose between aligning with a faction that supports magical creatures' rights, or one that seeks to, to regulate them more strictly. This choice could affect future interactions, potentially altering available side quests and activities, or influencing relationships with new NPCs. By giving players this sense of agency, the game could become even more replayable, offering multiple paths to experience the story. The original game offered breathtaking renditions of Hogwarts and its surrounding areas, but it left many players wishing for more opportunities to explore beyond the castle grounds. The definitive, the definitive edition presents the perfect opportunity to expand the map and introduce new, iconic locations from the wizarding world. One such edition could be Diagon Alley where players could shop for rare magical items, ingredients, or even undertake merchant-related quests. Another possibility is the inclusion of the hog's meat during a winter season, allowing players to experience new activities like the Wizarding Holiday Festival. Expanding the world beyond Hogwarts could breathe new life into the game, offering players more diverse environments to explore, each with its unique side quests and challenges. While the original Hogwarts Legacy featured a dynamic combat system, there's room for improvement in terms of the variety and depth. The Definitive Edition could introduce new spells as well as advanced customization options for combat spells, allowing players to tailor their abilities based on their playstyles. For instance, players could modify spells like Expelliarmus or Lavioso to have elemental effects such as fire or ice, giving each encounter more strategic depth. Additionally, the introduction of the new enemy types, from magical beasts to dark wizards, with more sophisticated combat tactics, could raise the stake in battles. Incorporating more intricate enemy AI and multi-phased boss battles would challenge even veteran players, adding a layer of the complexity that would enhance the overall combat experience. Beyond combat and exploration, Hogwarts Legacy offered various magical activities, such as potion making and herbology. However, these activities felt somewhat superficial and could be significantly expanded in a definitive edition. One idea is to introduce competing dueling tournaments, where players face increasingly difficult opponents in a bracket-style competition with unique rewards tied to the victory. Another potential activity could be adding a, a Quidditch, the iconic wizardry sport that was notably absent from the original game. While Quidditch is a, an ambitious feature to implement even a simplified version, focusing on strategy and skill-based mini-games would satisfy fans who have long wished to take to the skies on a broomstick and something more than just traveling. Expanding on a puzzle-based content would also be a significant win. The inclusion of more complex magical puzzles, perhaps tied to ancient runes or enchanted vaults, could offer an additional layer of challenge for the players who enjoy using their wits to solve riddles and over overcome obstacles. These puzzles could even be tied to the lore of the wizarding world, further de deepening the sense of the immersion. The Definitive Edition should take a step forward 
in inclusivity by offering a wider range of character customization options. This could include more diverse hairstyles, skin tones, body types and facial features, allowing players to create characters that feel more representative of themselves. An expanded wardrobe with new outfits and accessories could also be introduced, enabling players to customize their look not only for the aesthetics, but also with the stat-based benefits for specific spells or activities. One of the highlights of Hogwarts Legacy was the ability to build relationships with fellow students, but these interactions felt somewhat, well, limited. The Definitive Edition could flesh out these relationships further, with companion quests that are more in-depth and emotionally engaging. For instance, players could embark on a new companion quest where they help a friend navigate a difficult personal decision, such as reconciling their family's dark past with their desire to do good. These quests could result in different outcomes based on the player's advices and actions, adding more complexity to the relationships within the game. Further, incorporating a system where players can form a long-lasting friendships or rivalries could add a new dynamic, especially if the relationship influenced gameplay elements like quest rewards, dialogue options, or even combat assistance in certain scenarios. While the main campaign of Hogwarts Legacy was engaging, there were limited post-game content once the story was complete. The Definitive Edition could introduce new end-game activities, such as Challenging Tower, where players face waves of increasingly difficult enemies, or even seasonal events that rotate in real time. These events could tie into the changing seasons at Hogwarts, offering unique quests, cosmetic items, or even new enemies tied to the seasonal themes. Additionally, offering a new Game Plus mode would allow players to replay the game with their existing abilities and items, but with enhanced difficulty or even new narrative choices. This would add tremendous replay value, encouraging players to return to Hogwarts for yet another adventure. Hogwarts Legacy Definitive Edition has the potential to be more than just a collection of the additional content, with careful attention to the storytelling, exploration, combat, inclusivity, and post-game content, it could elevate an already beloved game to new heights. Fans of the Wizarding World deserve a definitive experience that expands the magic and wonder of the original, while addressing areas where the base game could have offered more depth. It's clear that the right updates and additions for this edition would be a welcome. But nevertheless, tell me down in the comments if you would like to see some of these features and wishlists within the definitive edition of Hogwarts Legacy. Thank you so much for watching, like and subscribe. I'll see you guys all and have a wonderful day.